This one's pretty good. Um... Okay, world roots are available. Ugh. Select a force currently in a magical forest region and collect the deep roots button to travel between them. No one is currently in the deep roots, so it's not you. But if I have dirt. Ooh. Oh, is it Dirthu I wanted to send? Yeah, it was. So now Dirthu is able to world tree. He can go over here. Is Dirthu your emissary? That's why. Here he is. Dirthu. Hanging out with the Laurel Longforest. <laughs> Might get mad at me trespassing, but I can suck it up. <laughs> I see the Empire has made a little progress on confederating in these two northern provinces. Skarsnik. Just sitting in his base. Like him. I mean, that's how I play Skarsnik. Never go for Karak 8 Peaks. Rename your original city Karak 8 Peaks. And then you're, you've already done it. Oh, I forgot that. I've got to change the sister's mount. I'll do that now. And let's see fly around on a dragon. Interestingly, uh, not on a dragon considers its mount none. Is oh. Not how that works. Okay. Um, <laughs> yep. Uh, turns out eagle is their foot. Mm, uh, yes. Maybe they're fused to the eagle. Uh, yeah. They're fused to each other. So. <laughs> maybe this is actually. Maybe they're actually some sort of like throck creation. The, he's the second great creation of throck. The sisters of twilight. <laughs> Where he just took two elves and stuck them together with some glue. Uh, it's poisons. It's the purple poison wind, poison wind globe days that are the good ones, right? Uh, it's the ones that are good against infantry. Oh, poison. Wait. Globe days? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. The regular ones no, are think, fine. Yeah, they're just anti large and short range anti large units don't tend to do Amazing, their eh? job that well. Large units are typically uh, quite quick. Yes. Um, I do find globe days in general. Uh, fill a niche that I'm not especially interested in filling as the Skaven. Like, I think basically all the other artillery options are better. Uh, um... right. uh, yeah, basically only hire the regiment right now. But that's fine. One of the toughs having a... He's having a tough day to actually, like, you know, succeed any of his tasks, so... God, good thing... Good I had to hire you for a thing. I'm annoyed that I can't look at the special building in Erengrad. It's oh, oh, there's no way it's anything. Like it's definitely only going to be the docks, and it's just going to be the same as it's reversed. I'm like so. What are the Skaven have like special building locations, right? Obviously, they have Hellpit, and they have Skaven yes. Blight. Um, basically, every Skaven capital will have a unique food building that's generally quite strong. Mm. Um, so that will be the Richter's clan nest. And the actual original, like, Clan Rictus home back, uh, like, you have in the Wolf Mountains or whatever. Um, so yeah, so all the cap, all the all the Skaven capitals, all six of them. Um, other Skaven unique buildings, like some of the like, like the Black Pyramid will have something, but not like a uniquely Skaven building, mm -hmm. just the evil aligned one. Um, I don't know of any others. Uh, for Skaven in particular, but I can get that up on my other screen. You give a quick look for um, ones near me. Sure. While I do this, uh, Warlock Masters—they're the best lords. I can't, I've forgotten. I feel like I remember them all being kind of good. Uh, I like Warlock Masters the most, just because. Like they're wizards, right? Yeah, they're wizards, and they also get good mounts, so they're yeah. fine in melee and stuff. Their mounts a uh, Doomwheel? Doomwheel, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty or good. Or Doomflare, if you prefer Doomflare. Like, I think that's a personal choice. I could have um, a confident Warlord. Any good Gracias? I know Gracias Gal oh, Go on. Galbaraz has a unique Skaven building. Dwarf building, right? Galbaraz? Yeah. Uh, yeah I, I mean, that would make sense, right? 
the Fortress of Vorag has one, but that's the same as it is for basically all the factions. Uh, Master of Got Grond in Nagaroth has one. The Golden Tower in Lustria. Are these near you? <laughs> uh, I feel like I'm pretty close to Lustria. Help it has one. Hexalatl. <laughs> Iron Rock, that's down near um that place. Yep. I mean, would it surprise me if there aren't that many? Because obviously, because Throt's the last of the Skaven DLC in a place in the world where there isn't much. Like, they probably haven't planned for factions to invade Norska. Yeah. Because no and, factions and, like, have really been positioned to do that apart from, like, warriors, but they don't build buildings. Yeah, so. and the clan Angren capital has one. Um, sisters, uh, not sisters, the French aren't willing to pay me for peace. You, you don't want understand to kill what our her. war is about. Yeah. <laughs> Um, our war is about you specifically, and how I like to yeah, eat, and, eat like, your flesh. Skaven obviously don't make a ton of sense as having unique buildings. Like they're not, they don't tend to do that. They're not they unique. Don't. You argue? Every Skaven is unique, Matt. Come on. Okay. Um, there's two in Skaven Blight. Well, one day I hope that I will capture Skaven Blight, but it is not this day. Kiss left first. I'm, so, I'm a little unfortunate that I didn't meet Ikitclaw. Yeah, I would like to, if you could meet Ikitclaw, that would be helpful. Yeah. Well, you meet Draco and then we'll talk. <laughs> yeah, this invasion should be fine. I guess Skarsnick's very strong trait. Where's Skarsnick's trait? Ambush chance. Oh, that one is pretty good. Not as good, of course, as um, Clan Angrind. Love that extra intercept chance. Oh, sure. Ooh, oh god! Okay. I was given the choice to fight a weak army or a strong army and picked strong army. Um, is it really strong? Yep. Is it just Hellblast of all guns? I don't think I can fight this. Can you leave? Yeah, you can leave. Cool. But here they are now. Is that guy just there? Can you can you see this army? I can see that he exists. I can't see anything in his uh, army. So his army, three Marauder Champions, mm -hmm. a unit of Berserkers, and a Chariot. Yep. That's its infantry. That's kind of that's fine. Mm -hmm. Two Marauder Horse Masters. Those are good. Tier three mm -hmm. infantry. Yeah. Can't complain. Uh War Mammoth, War Mammoth, Royal Shrine, two Frostworms, three other mammoths, a giant, a master core, some armored skin wolves, some Fimir with great weapons, and some trolls. That sounds pretty That's a lot of big beasties. Yeah, it's pretty good. What the hell is a frostworm? Uh, that's the Frost Dragon? That's the, yeah, it's a frost dragon. Okay, cool. I don't know. If I beat these, Never it would complete them. my quest. That's true. But, but like, I can't They will these. kill you. They will kill all of you. Um, Just hide next to the tree and become yeah, their allies I'll, or something. We'll see how this plays out. Um, I could... No, that's pointless. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's... That was a lot spookier than I was I expecting. hope you don't die, Dirthu. Yeah. I mean, at least if he dies, it's not the end of your campaign as it would be for someone else. Uh, yeah, agreed. But it would be... Pretty Obviously irritating, bad. yes, but can't get more waystalkers. Yes. Yeah. Um sure. <laughs> Bless you. Oh, I wonder can any of these reduce the movement speed of enemy armies? Do you have hinder replenishment? Oh. Um, you have Assault unit. You all suck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think if they attack and I retreat, I'll be fine. But yeah, when it it gave me the choice of fight an, a smaller force or get two thousand gold from fighting a bigger force, I was like, well, Dirthy's army's pretty good. Dirthy himself is strong. And he's got three units of waystalkers. He can probably take what the game considers a stronger force. But uh, if they do attack us, I might have to fight. But I'd rather not. Uh, what I think would be cooler than like an assault unit ability is like an, a sabotage artillery ability. Yeah, that would be fun, right? Like and and thematic. Hmm. Or like a sabotage something ability. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Just like like assault single unit is a thing, but yeah, it, it doesn't do what it. Yeah, obviously, to but it just replenish if they're in their territory, which they often are. It just replenishes immediately. Agreed. That is always the problem with. 
certainly Assault Garrison is garbage for that reason. Like, mm. unless you're going to immediately siege it that turn, Assault Garrison will just do yeah. anything. And even Whereas, even then it um, assault, assault Walls, I think it's actually quite good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, sometimes it's way better than having a siege attacker. Mm, plenty uh, of uses. And if you, and if you some, do it for a long that... period of time, the walls don't regenerate quickly enough to stop yeah, yeah. the continual sure. blowing up of the walls. And yeah, if your army is very cavalry-based or whatever. Mm. Uh... Hello, Manfred von Karstein! You met Hockland and Tabakland? Those are both... Oh, what? Yeah. Why What? Why are you here? This You, should, <laughs> you shouldn't be here. <laughs> oh, uh, guess I am fighting some vampires then. What strength rank are you? 18? Okay, you must have just taken the city and like just have some, something in the south. Lost lost the capital or something, yeah. Got, that got, that's a gold mine as well, though. Hmm. Alright, so if Throt spends one more turn recruiting rat ogres, how good is that for me? Let's have a think. So I'm only making 614 gold a turn. But I've got an extra lord who's going to be disbanded uh, after he settles the Volksgrad. So, Rat Ogre's costs. This is the kind of math I never do. 154 a turn. Uh, Night Runners cost 128. So it's only an upgrade of 25 gold. That feels like just profit. <laughs> sure, I'm going to trust you did that math. I shouldn't, but I am going to. Well, no, okay. The Night Runners have an upkeep of 128. It's on their card. And okay. the Rattlers have an upkeep of 154. Sure. Maybe it's because of the discount because of um. Yeah, actually. I think su yeah. supply lines isn't coming into account necessarily. Maybe I don't know. Um, maybe, but again, supply lines is going to matter because I'm going to disband my other army in a minute. So. Oh, I fucked this up. Um... So if I disband all my infantry, I can make them all into units of Rattlers. I mean, that just sounds more fun, right? <laughs> yeah. We're playing Throttle the Unclean, not Clam Rat from Clam Rat. Alright, one turn. Then, Kislev, you're going to get a whooping. Oh, another ability I'm not super into is um, uh, Steel Technology. I don't find that one super useful. Technology doesn't do what you would think it does until it's specced into, which is really weird. Like, Wait, you would expect. You, well, it doesn't increase your technology. Oh, what? <laughs> it just decreases their research rate. What? That's worse! Uh, until you spec into it, where, like, at three points, then you are getting plus whatever it is, 10%, 20%. And that, and that can be really powerful. Like, if you, you can stack that, especially for... And some of the factions have, like, these impossibly large tech trees. I think Skaven is one of those. Um... Sure. Okay, this is fine. Plague. Oh, my best friend, Tretch Cravendale. Wait, you're a war with Tretch Cravendale? Yeah, yeah. This isn't good Probably because I want to be friends with him. Probably going to lose another one here when Carcasson takes back Castle Carcasson, unfortunately. Yeah. Because they recruit this army in one turn, which is what? kind of... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Britannia does have, have, have ridiculous... Uh, well, they're AI, they cheat, don't they? <laughs> Those cities aren't super important. They're both uh, heart cities, so I do, I'm do. i going to have to work to get them back. I mean, it's not the, the end of the world. for Carcassonne, once you've got enough fair enchantress farms, you can just wipe out their faction. And, oh, like, for sure. Yeah. I just, then then you'll not be at war with the other Bretonians. Okay. Who, These guys. Oh, I can't retreat. That's interesting. Okay, uh, we're going to have to fight this. Okay. Uh, the train is forest, so we get a bunch of bonuses, which is nice. Oh, the bar's not... Super horrible. No. I'm just terrified of all their monsters. Okay, let's think about this for a second then. So, what's the Feral Mammoth? How good's their armor? Probably not great. 30. 30? You've got a lot of. Arrows are typically kind of good against monsters. They don't, they don't have a single shot. unit with a shield in their whole army. Yeah, so that's, that, that's kind of good. That's Actually, good, sure. We've got Dirthu. Dirthu is pretty yep. good. He gives regen to the forest spirits, is that? Yeah, they've all got regen. So we've got some dryers with regen. I don't know how good the dryers will be, but... No. Okay. Uh, yeah. We can definitely do some shoot. Like, it's mainly a question of can dryers hold at all versus several mammoths and skin wolves and thin air and stuff. We might have to just play a very skirmishy game 
Mm. Um, which is fine. Those Wiggles are fun. Are very good at that. Those are fun. Um, we'll have to take out the frostworms pretty quickly if that's the case. And the yeah. cav. Ugh, the cav's going to be nice. We have two years of our cav. Yeah. Uh, I need to go uh, BRB for one second. So. Okay. Just, you know. I'll deploy and stuff. Oh, this terrain looks good for us, actually. Like, it's very foresty and very, very hilly. Cool. Yeah, we you're right. To... All right, one sec. Ooh. This is interesting. <sighs> I don't think we want to corner camp because... Yeah, so let's, let's talk about this. So... I don't think we want a corner camp because I think we want the ability to skirmish backwards. Um, the main advantage of corner camping is it's going to make cav harder to charge us. But I think our plan for the cav is to fight them with our own cav. Um, I don't know how effective that's going to be, but we're definitely going to try. Um, in the past, before this patch, I would not be wanting to fight in these forests because how arrows work. Still not convinced I want to be fighting in like the deep forest. Like okay. taking this low ground seems wrong. So I'll just approach through the forest. We could take this ridge. But then if they approach up here. Try and take this section, which is like Fast trees. Oh man, it's super worth fighting in the forest though. Those buffs are huge. Okay. Um. I'm gonna hate my camera for this fight. Okay, so I think we're gonna we are gonna deploy up on this ridge. Kind of near the edge of the forest. Nice wipe there. These guys don't have anger to comment quickly. Like this. These guys are here. Cool. So we are back uh, after some unfortunate disconnects, and we are deployed like this. We are trying to fight in the forest to make use of our quite powerful forest spirit buffs. But was the tide anyone seeing anything? going on in this battle. Yeah. Uh, and hopefully our, our archers are able to actually shoot through these trees. It's been a problem in the past, but in theory it's better now. Um, if not, we'll and monsters get penalties, so yeah. Okay. Uh, I've got the two units of cavalry. My job is to kill cavalry and distract. That's, that's my vibe. We are shooting dragons. That's our prerogative right now. Yeah, distracting also going to be very important. Uh, oh, yeah. Unless this dragon to be on walk. <laughs> Doesn't, don't they go at the same speed if they're on? Yep. But they're, well, they're going very slowly. I don't. I don't. I don't think they're meant to be this slow. Sure. Oh, look at that one. That one's dead. Yeah, but the other ones are. Uh, I'm coming yeah, for uh, the Marauder Horseman on the left. I'm coming for with the Stagnites. So, great. You can redirect uh, your your ads. Gonna turn the speed down to slow because there's a lot of stuff going on. Um, I'm just jumping here. You're doing fine. Good job. You lot. Can shoot at the War Shrine, you mammoth. Death, you get ready to tank. <laughs> here it comes. Yeah, that will be fine. I'm not, I'm not particularly worried about Death, to be honest. I'm more worried about the dryads and stuff, they might get destroyed. Like, like, Fimir with great weapons, yeah. Yeah, I'm a little bit concerned about these armored skin wolves that are also just guarding the cavalry over here. Bit irritating. Oh, I'm on a horseman, hold muscles quicker than me. 90, so... Yeah, no, they're exactly like the same speed as me. Okay. Wild Riders faster than I expected. No, that's a stack knife. Oh. Wild Riders are 85, so they're fractionally slower. Well, yes, it would have been faster than I was expecting for, for Wild Riders. Got, got that correct. Yeah, mission success. Oh. Alright, Skin Wolves, let's go for a run. Your speed's 65, you losers. 
these voice talkers go back, so they're back to melee, which obviously they already are. Flyer's pretty strong. Yeah. Yeah, this doesn't feel great. I think great in every right game now. I've ever played, flying has been just an incredibly good useful ability. Yes, turns out an extra dimension of travel. Mm, strong. strong. If you get enough time to shoot these monsters, I think you're going to be fine. Yeah, it's just a problem of even trying to hold that line is, is tricky. Yeah. Um, the fact the flyers have been dealt with is really good. So that is definitely an extremely positive uh, shift for us. But like, yeah, it's, it's rough, you know? Hmm. Uh, just... The wild riders have distracted three units, though. Yes, that's been great too. The fact that Cav aren't messing with us. And this unit of uh, Royal Champions, like, I'm going to catch those Stag Knights who are chasing my Horse Masters. Let's go. Sure. I am perfectly positioned to do this as an infantry unit. Their speed's only three times mine, it's fine. Some of the units are starting to break. That, that's great news. A fair amount of, yeah, they can't have that much leadership, right? Yeah, yeah, monsters just don't. Currently it's three, but I imagine it's normally higher than three. This one I'm looking at, specifically. No, I'm pretty sure three is their normal. Oh, okay. Place. They just instantly break whenever anything, anything happens. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Dorothy's doing fine now. That's good. Let's buff the defense with this unit. I was like, what's that tiny flying thing in the middle of this pile of monsters? Just a tiny manticore. Just <laughs> yeah, there is a the manticore for some reason. I don't... Are they a dark elf thing, manticores? No, I mean, feral manticores are, are chaos as well. Sure. Fundamentally, they had the model from Law of Beasts and stuck it where they felt like it. <laughs> it's in the Dreitch campaign, which I actually thought was kind of cool. Yeah, I, I liked all the, like, all, this... all the Dreitch. No, I didn't like how the, the bats were just fell bats with the same and picture the... and everything. It's fine. Like, again, that, she's FLC, I think. Yeah, but they could have just recolored the background, I think, and that would have done enough. Sure. Like, make it green or something, you know? I'm, I'm fine with the zero effort for okay. free, I'll see. The stack nice have caught this cavalry unit. Good job, boys. Earthy with the zero kills, but he's fighting a bunch of monsters. He's fighting a bunch of monsters. All three arrows of Colonel's gonna hit. Have to kill this boss worm? Yeah, basically. Yeah, our front line's going. Possible we were meant to deploy like way further back so that they came in in drips and draps, drabs more. Let's pretend that those were words. Like, because <laughs> some of their monsters, like their giant, is way slower than the rest of their army, and like their flyers would have come at us sooner and stuff. I think that might have been better. Like this hill hasn't mattered that much, and it's possible that the um, bonuses would have get got by stalling them would have been significantly more important here. I feel like this battle isn't lost or anything. Um, but not, I guess I'm maybe. paying less attention. We just don't have any front line left. It's all, sure. it's all, it's all gone. Uh, some of it's rallying. Oh, so. Yes, and certainly him tanking four monsters helps a lot. But uh, we just don't have that much else going for us right now. Like, how many monsters are dead? Like, two frostworms, at least one mammoth, and the rest Manticore. are dead. There's a lot of injured ones as well. Basically dead. Is it? Wait, no. There's an injured something or other up on the hill. Oh, yeah, that's a, that's one of the mammoths. Sure. Trolls gone. Uh, have you got a unit to chase them? No. No. Don't have any melee units. <laughs> no. Um, I'll try and thread... Ugh. I can't thread the needle with these wild riders, but... It's fine. Run, you dryads. Run away, dryads. Rallying's great, but, but I can't really have you come back right now. Oh, you guys can come back then. Oh, you've got a um, spell singer. She can chase the uh, trolls. 
I guess she could. Yeah, she's got enough fancy. Fine. She might not keep them fleeing, but she might. Yeah, I think it's worth doing. Where's their lord fighting you? Okay. Oh, did you see that one of the changes in this patch is they gave spellcasters no minimum range? I didn't see that, no. Basically, all spells can be cast directly on the caster now. Cool. Um, which, I you thought I wanted to flame blast myself. Well, yeah, it's not always a good decision, yeah, but yeah. the option's really nice. Like, I've definitely had, like, some lords just have really high magic resist and would love to cast spells on themselves. Mm, yes, dwarf lords. No, yeah, for their magic those, prowess. Those dwarf lords spellcasters, yeah, yeah. Mm. Nice try for me, too slow. Yeah, I just can't tell how much difference these trees are making to my TPS. It's a very injured oh. mammoth on the on the right side. The one that's just rallied, yeah. Yeah, he's just fleeing again, so. What kills Femir Warriors? Shooting. Okay. I definitely think even if well, for this fight's We're we're doing fine. We we've got we Maybe got this. I'm scared. <laughs> Uh, the Wild Riders suck, because I'm getting the vibe they kind of suck. I, yeah, I, yeah, they're all the absolute garbage. Yeah, they're I, like Yeoman. I'm like, like, don't expect them to do better than Yeoman. Okay, so don't expect them to do anything. <laughs> they're, they're very, very bad. Sure, because I'm like thinking all the back of these combats, I'm like, can I engage any of these units? <laughs> it's part of the reason that Orion is so trash, is that he buffs them, and like, why? But <laughs> it's like a problem that only buffs Yeoman. Yeah, yeah. Though, truth how... be told, I would actually quite like Petonian Lord that like, focused a lot on peasants. Because that's like a thing from, in thing theory, from the game. Be. Um, nah, she's Grail. She's Team Grail Knights. Sure, it's true. She's the Grail Guardian. If we can get their Lord, they're gonna stop rallying. Which would be really nice. Where is that Lord? Who is it? Like, is like a guy on foot, the, or he's a yeah, yeah, just a more chieftain. Just more chieftain leading army of just so many monsters. As you do. Yeah. Alright, skin walls, I'm gonna chase ya. Chase you with these wild riders, hopefully. Hopefully I'll get there in time. No, you've already rallied, fuck. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, they're, ter they're terrified, they're not they're not fleeing. My bad. Oh uh, yeah, see this is the problem now, my spell thing is just fighting trolls. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> what else was she doing though? She was casting her spells on cooldown. They weren't doing very much, but she was, you know, trying her best. What was she doing her best? Uh, me. I don't know why, I just looked at this giant and I was like, oh man, I can't wait for ogres. <laughs> I think the Chaos Giants look pretty cool. Like, they look way better than the Orcs and Goblins Giants. Ooh, my Glare Captain's back. Nice. The Beastman ones, right. I think, actually look the best. They've got, like, this cool fur and stuff going on. Never seen them. No, <laughs> what are Beastmen? Do they even exist? Are Beastmen real? Those are the, like, the wolf rats, right? The Skaven? <laughs> yeah. Beastmen are just a weird type of Skaven, that's true. Pretty sure Clan Mulder invents Beastmen. Yeah, that's true. I mean, the Skaven have done enough with the law. They don't need to do everything. Like, yeah. The answer was always it was a Skaven did it. Oh, mm. Wild Riders, will you beat these wolves? No. What if we say, go to the go? Will that help? It worked! <laughs> Finish them! Nice. My guy's gonna stop shooting them. Good. Okay, yeah. Uh, Dorothy has dealt, dealt 18,000 damage. Right? That's a lot of damage. Uh, yeah, but he's killed zero monsters, so he's a failure. Right? He's got 14 kills. Um, I think my. Have you got anyone to kill that lord that's just chilling in the middle? Oh. What, what units do you think I have? I don't know, man! <laughs> I've only, I only have... got one eye on your edge of the fight. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I don't. It, I have 
I have archers. That's that's it. That's all, right. all I've got. So like 14, 14 health drads. <laughs> If we win this battle, remember we can confederate the nearby tree and recruit more dryads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I think winning at any cost here is fine. Uh, Are the dryads three. always purple now? It looks alive. No, they shouldn't be. No. All right, those walls are dead. I've got the regiment renowned ones. That's probably yeah. The they're purple. Ones. Yeah, yeah. Because the regiment's renowned, yeah, it could be purple. It's the rule. Yeah. Death will slap. Just, yeah, we're running out of ammo on our waste orcas oh, now. Oh no, we're running out of people to fire on the opponent. Yeah. Definitely didn't think the infantry would be what finally got us, but. Basically, it is. Oh, we rallied. That's actually really good. How are there two Marauder Berserkers? Just fine in the middle of everything that's going on. Agreed. Alright, my Warrior is going to go for their Lord. Let's see how, let's see how this goes. Sure. Use your blue antlers of death or something. Yeah, go flying so we can't hit you for a bit. Nice. Okay, we did shatter the Berserkers. I think there's one left. They're dead. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I do think if we if we refought this battle, we could win it. Like I do think it was we we fundamentally needed to be fighting them uh, further back, like because mm. it, it started to go wrong when the infantry arrived. Like their monsters were fine, we were we were handling them, but uh, just needs time. Maybe just yeah, staggered our line. More time to be shooting. Yeah, could also have seen that. I just I, I definitely don't do that often enough. The Lord's fleeing. Oh no, he's waving. Now he's playing. Now he's playing. Yeah, but ugh, these, these big blocks of infantry are still like here and doing okay, which is a problem. Yeah, Stag Knights might be good, good enough against Marauder Champions that we've still got this. Maybe. Like, cause Let's find if out. We can get, uh, if we can get the Marauders down, they really don't have anything else. Um, the, the leadership has crumbled those to Those trolls have regenerated a bunch. Where are the trolls? So you know Glaygard uh, um, at the, the back right. that have rallied and they're facing the wrong way. They have 360 degree angles. They don't oh, do they? Okay, cool. Oh, Glaygard, sorry. That, no, I thought... Waywatchers have the 360. Um, well, the stacks have almost broken these Marauder Champions. Uh, what, yeah, that Wild Riders was great. probably should come and chase them. Oh, fuck all else to do. So. Yeah, if those can charge the We're other. We're coming, the yep. Yeah, yeah. We're already on our way. We're just blasting Marauders into the other Marauders. <laughs> it's a slight downhill advantage for this one as well. Oof. This is all see. Oh, we sent some elves flying. Sorry. It's fine. They're way, way watches that ammo. They're worthless. <laughs> They're dead to me. Okay, it's just, yeah, it's just the bridge archers are crumbling in their leadership. Especially with their lords. Just, don't know where he's gone. But... Oh, I know the horsemen are back, but they never caught them. <laughs> <laughs> What is this? 
A manticore back? Yeah, the manticore's been here forever. <laughs> Alright, they're both fleeing. Giant's almost dead as well. 300 health? Yeah, I'm, I've been focusing on the giant with Darth and some of my archers, because I think killing it is going to ensure that Darth lives, whereas yeah. at the moment that's not clear. Uh, for me, are anti large, right? Let's not charge them. Uh, the anti yeah, they are anti large. Run away! Prance away! Giant down. Yeah, I don't know. Don't think we take a mammoth on his own. Because he. Well, I'm gonna help! Pretty good. Because I'm on the way past. Yeah, jump into it. Use your prancy powers. Oh, that impacted his leadership very little. Okay. <laughs> Should we kill that lord? No, he's still alive. Where is he? Uh, here. I didn't. I didn't see. That. Sorry, I didn't see the yeah. line. There. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Wild riders, get him. Yes, agreed. I think wild riders are perfectly suited. They're also very close. The trolls. I don't know what the trolls are doing. They're sort of running around I'm, over there. I'm, I'm happy that they're over there. It's fine. Yeah. Do we have any arrows for these bloody fucking horsemen? I just can't Only catch. my characters okay. have arrows left. And like this, you know, of Glade God for some reason. Alright, for me. Get rid of your leadership broken. War shrine also down. That's good. Prance, boys, prance! Prancing successful. For me, going? Sort of. They might work out they're actually really good against stag knights before they leave. Nope, they didn't work out. So there's the chariot and the horse masters and the trolls, and that's it. Yeah, I think you should shoot the horse masters. They almost have ammo, but yeah. Well, that I will chase them forever with the stag knights, and eventually I'll get them, and they will die. But cool, the war shrine's down. Oh, they're Which also their morale's going. Yeah. yeah. Nice. <coughs> Slag Knights for the win. <coughs> yeah, no, they did great at the end there, certainly. I mean, they I, they were chasing a horseman across the battlefield for most of the game. But... Yeah, trading horsemen for, for Slag Knights is not a trade I would, like, would take. Uh, well, that's what happened. I think, <laughs> yeah, I think they could have perhaps been more useful uh, if they'd been fighting more often, but it's fine. Yeah, my... We'll see how many dryads live, but it's probably. But you not can very federate nice. the elves, and you can recruit yeah, yeah. more dryads. Yeah, it, it is a well worth fight. <laughs> Mostly, I made the incorrect decision on choosing to fight a harder army. That was a very <laughs> poor decision. Um, the two thousand gold or whatever is not remotely worth it. Um, I thought it would be like the pirate ones. Where even the scariest pirate army would lose to this Durthu stack. <laughs> um, if you look at it critically, this Durthu stack is mainly like tier one infantry, right? Yeah. Um, I guess sorry, tier one infantry. Two units of drives. That's actually okay. Three percent. Are these way watchers? Sorry, way watchers are quite high level, right? They're tier four. They're, they're, tier four. they're probably the best after sisters. The best archers in the game. Um, Not Tim King archers. I'd put them first, to be honest. Yeah, I know you would. Because <laughs> it's correct, Matthew. <laughs> Twist, bend, mangle, experiment! Oh, it does count as confederation. Okay, that's better. No, uh, it means I get the penalty. But you keep uh, the tree at the right level. Yeah, I, I, I knew I was go like it was always going to be a confederation. It was a question of whether it counted as uh, confederation for like public order and stuff. And now I can't confederate anyone else for several turns. Sure, like, that's what I was worried about. Um, and we are injured. Uh, 
Oh. Let's have this army do it and just auto resolve because we're not keeping any of these troops. Good job. I money because this army is not real. <laughs> Interestingly, our economy says we can actually support this. Sounds I, I mean, the army is just basic guys, so. Yeah. I'm not saying that's not an argument to the spam though, I'm just saying they can't be that yeah. expensive, right? Yeah, yeah. Mm. So now you're over here, is your goal to take the heartland or What? What's the what's now that Dirth is here? Oh, um What's the plan? Yeah, I I don't I don't know if we're gonna be declaring war on Midland. Um you're gonna kill Northern? Yeah. That'd be easier of the two. Yeah, we'll see. Strong. Um... Or you could just walk over to Dreitcher. <laughs> yeah. But my assassin's on their way. So strong. So strong. I'll take this one. Um... Yep, yep, yep. Let's keep taking the stuff we take on our heroes. Die through your very having a bad time. Yeah, so we could take. How many cities is Three? That's about three, yeah. What on earth are you? You're a waystalker? Another one? That was insane. Um... You're another waystalker? Why? There's too many waystalkers. Okay, you can go find Dryker. Good luck. Oh, Great Stag Knights are actually tier 5. Oh, are they? Yeah. Great Stag ones are the ones that you have, right? Yeah, yeah. Is there like Wild Riders, Stag Knights, Great Stag Knights? Yeah, so Wild Riders are tier... No, Wild Riders are tier 3. Mm -hmm. Blade Riders, which are the ranged ones, are tier 2. But they're terrible for tier 3, Jesus. Uh, and then there's Sisters of tier Sisters 4. Sisters of Thorn tier 4, okay. I'm going to delete the cab building. I don't think it's very good. Are Sisters of Thorn any good? They're okay, they're spellcasters. They're like a two, they're like a warlock unit, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah. They serve a, a certainly unique a unique niche. Uh, we're pretty worried about this, and we're pretty worried about like I can't peace out with him. Let's see if I can peace out with anyone. Rictus. No. Crooked Moon doesn't have any settlements, so who cares? Oh no. Disgusting. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty concerned that I just don't have any way of dealing with Tretch's invasion. Uh, because you're at war with Tretch, are you? Me? No. Oh, you are. No, here, uh, Tap. Okay. I'm yes, they declared war last turn. Okay, cool. I'm gonna have Katap trying to take the city off. Get me, get me my heartland back. Let's see how it goes. Um. So, Garthic's dead. I can probably take three normal sisters, or I can just go back to Carcassonne. Once again, poor Garthic schemes. Just not enough. And then we got Phoenix over here. You're very interesting, Phoenix. Master of Scryer. This army's just. This army's okay. Like, if this was turn one, this army would be great. Um, well, you can just as use... a support army for Dirthy. You can use it's pretty strong. Yeah, it's a solid support yeah. army for Dirthy because it's just twenty units of guys. Yeah, yeah. 
for sure. But bodies. you just need to decide what you're doing with Dorothy. <laughs> Yeah, I think it is fighting Nordland. I think that will go fine. Like, it's only a problem if the Norskans start declaring on me and then I have to defend them. That would annoying. be actually a pain in the ass. Um, do you have really, any I need inherent to... aversion to the Norskans as Wood Elves? I hate everyone. Wood Elves. Everyone, everyone hates the Wood Elves. Everyone hates the Wood Elves, okay. Um... Everyone, everyone, like the faction that likes me the second most is at minus two. Wow. <laughs> you are also a great power. You've got a lot of territory. Yeah, yeah. I'm strength rank two. Um, yeah, I'm probably strength rank nowhere near two. We haven't met number one. Uh, probably not, I guess. Tyrion? Tyrion. You're, you're 65. Yeah, I haven't even got half a stat currently because I'm a group. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm about to take all of Levin. I'm striking Blitzkrieg, so... Yeah. Machines and then sorcery. Cool, good job, Nick. You have captured the city. Proud of you. I am fraught, the unclean. Uh, yeah, it's pretty hard to hit. What level's Brutar? 14. Thrawn, what level's your mount? 14. Uh, hey, Kislev. Your army consists mainly of pistoliers. I guess that might be a problem for an army of just Rogers, but. <laughs> Uh, Force Struck or... It's got a tiny garrison. Let's just let's just kill your army. Let's go. Do you have the big scary boys? You don't. Okay. Slice body. Keep organs. Nor chew bones. Nor chew. Nope. For keep forgetting menace bellows. He's not doing it now. I've clicked it twice, yeah. I don't know if that will do anything, but... Uh, this should be. We'll be fine. They've got a lot of spears. They're spearmen. Who cares? They're not. Yeah, they're not. They're not halberds. Not halberds. <laughs> they're also going to have to come to us because we've got two catapults and they haven't got any artillery. Congrats. Here are some rats. God love rats. Unfortunately, rats, that's rats. all I really got. <laughs> Potentially give me the artillery, but uh, who cares? Can if you want. Don't mind. That's... Get the boy first. Don't worry about that in a second. If I zoom in enough, there's a bunch of grass underneath this snow that I can't see <laughs> until I'm really zoomed in. Oh yeah! <laughs> Just like real life. Well, and then when I'm browsing through the forest, because I've got hide foliage, I get have like a circle of where I can see the grass. <laughs> it looks really bad. <laughs> Stop looking okay. at it. Games. A beautiful mess. <laughs> this game is not a mess. That's unfair. Alright, so five organ rat ogres. I can't see your organs right now, okay. So Frenzy and arm piercing. I think you all have arm piercing. Oh, you all have frenzy and arm piercing, okay. Got some extra combat stats, I guess. Yeah, you do more damage, cool. Ba 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 got some catapults. Gonna plague them up. 
Plague, you plague, plague. I'm gonna speed this up quickly so they get here faster. Seems fine. Plague, plague, plague. I'm gonna. Oh, they do have some Howards. Cool. A unit. Oh, they... the archers have all figured out the wolf rats exist. <laughs> Poof. Poof. Where are the hell is? Oh, they're, they're on that flank. Dick. Yeah. Oh, there's two units and there's one in the center as well. Oh, yes. I don't Ooh. think wolf rats can beat crossbowmen in melee. Feels optimistic. You've got one of them got water lightning. <laughs> two units might be able to beat one unit of crossbowmen. Yes. I think I'd get shot by others. Oh, that was a good hit. <laughs> yeah, I enjoyed it. What, what orders? Yeah. I'm gonna continue making their crossbowmen confused. Dot com. <laughs> Don't forget the line of sight on rattling guns is dumb. Yeah, yeah. So you have to do this. He's running around to the side, that's fine. Oh, the, the joy that is rattling guns. Yeah. It's so fun. Yeah. <laughs> You know, Rattle goes on the far right that could go follow some of archers pretty effectively. Cool. I think I'm significantly quicker than them. Yeah, I am. The Rattling Guns are chasing. It's their perfect, perfect roll. I mean, we've just crushed this. Like, <laughs> Yeah, their front line didn't hold at all. And their archers basically didn't fire any shots. Because yeah. they were really, really Distracted. focused on these wolf rats. Yeah. I think the pistol is at the most. Oh, there are generals here. That's cute. It's like how I'm still here. Fight me. My, my, my lord's coming for his lord. It's not large. No, he should be riding a horse. That would make me happier. He's also fast. Yeah, yeah, he is, but he's not. Yeah. And he just broke us. <laughs> too scary. I'm firing big balls of plague. This is a siege. Mate. Yeah, I did. end it. Could let Throt regenerate, but I think he's at full range. I think I don't think he fought anything. No, he was too slow. Like the Rattlers ran in, and he's like followed them, but he's like, I'm not as quick as you. And then they broke. Yeah. MVP, these wolf rats. Did you charge a unit crossbow with both of them in the end? See what happened. Uh, two of them could be a unit you know, crossbows. Good job. They could two not, of them. They could not win the one on one. Did you even try? Yeah, we a you new know. shield. Yeah. 
master engineer. Uh, any growth. <sighs> okay, so Fort Obras Ustrusk. No, I should probably go to Zwiskunk, then go to the fort. I imagine that that was Kislev's army. I don't have another one in the capital, but the capital's kind of far away. So. They don't have one in Erengrad, okay. Alright, so Throt should be able to clean up the north, like, kind of on his own for a little bit. Yes, yes. Sure. I mean, even if Kizla summons an army, how are they gonna... <laughs> like, Throt's army's really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the epic clash. Nagrond and Kalakarond. Oh, the, the orcs. You said they were doing well, they're dead. Wait, what? They had three Cs, they're like dead two now. turns ago. Dead. Huh? Like, where did this come from? This isn't even the other stack that was all piped. <laughs> they fight recruit troops so fast. Like, they are terrible, as I expected, but... It's definitely uh, your garrisons consist of only five guys because you're wooden. Yeah, so. your garrisons are terrible. Yeah, they they can't threaten your actual trees. Your trees will wreck them. No, but I do have to turn around and deal with them, which is fine. No crooked moon, Skarsnik, your schemes. 